Hello guys, today we have a very exciting product I would like to share with you guys. Here it is, just received into our office. A new product been launched globally in the market on the Mlit called Rich RS3. So now let's take a look what inside the box for the Rich RS3. So first let's take a look from the outside itself. So here you mention RS and tree. Okay, here the list for the equipment inside the box and the receiver itself. Yep, that's it. So let's open it. So here we have the uh, carrying case for the RS3 and then we have the manual book. And then inside here, actually they have the shoulder strap. So you can strap on your carrying case and go around on the side. Strap, carrying case, and the receiver itself inside the carrying case, and also the manual book. And let's take a look inside the carrying case. So we have here the Wish RS3 sub. If I take a look from the outside, the color a bit different, a bit more grayish, and then at the bottom here, even the pot, also now the same color. And then inside here, we have the LoRa radio, okay, same like the previous one, which RS2 Plus. And then they have the USB Type C cable for the charging, all inside the box for the Wish RS3. So the key upgrade being implemented inside the Rich RS3, that's the two I would like to cover on. The first one, a newly implement IMU sensor, where it can support the tip compensations, great deal for the survey industry. So on the second part, dual band radio, where it support a standard LoRa radio frequency with the like a previous RS2 Plus. And then the second one, the UHF 450 MHz, where it's compatible with other base stations that use the TrimTop 450S radio signal using a separate radio antenna provided from the Amblit to support the 450 MHz radio frequency. So now Rich RS3 available in the market. You can be the first, take the order, place the order, and reach out to us. If you have any question, any concern about the equipment, please don't hesitate to ask us. Our person in charge will be happily to guide your side on this.